the second day of Christmas, my pet gave to me the Crimson Vow. And we get. I take no joy in a Soren. Damage to an opponent. Stir Wolf Strike. Exile the top card of your library. First strike is lost to Tacky. Mm, we could do some vampire werewolf stuff. Target creature gets plus two with its knife. It deals damage equals its power to a creature you don't control. Pretty cool one. It's a cool buff. Yeah, I think we'll try to do some vampire. Red, black, maybe. Standard. Two Sorens. Let's put these in there. I do have a Soren, too. When Innistrad's son returns, my kind's oh, bloodlust will be contained. And the vampire. Alright. That's pretty cool. Alright, well, I'm gonna work on this bad boy. See what we can come up with. That's a good base. And I'll be back in a minute. All right, that's looking real good. So, um, day two of Christmas packs, and we went with Soren. We got Soren. We drew Soren from the pack, and we made a deck around him. So the initial thought was to get um, to the ultimate. Didn't happen. I only have two Sorens, so. Can't find him. I did put in some Beseech the Mirrors to try to fish for him, but usually it ended up uh, fishing for some other stuff. And then I was looking at the 13 damage, and so I put in some spells that did, you know, minus 13, and then to go along with the minus 13, minus 13, I think there's another one. There's also Olivia's Nightmare, Midnight Ambush. It's a one and one black. For minus two, but if it's nighttime, it's minus thirteen. So um, to go along with uh, with it being nighttime, we went with some werewolves. And the Celestis in order to start the day-night cycle and so there's a lot of um, werewolves most of them are two damage there are three casting costs so we got the shady traveler with has menace becomes a 4-4 at night we have the storm seeker great card gives haste to a creature so you can play a creature pump it up tack in and then um, if it's nighttime they also get trample and they get plus two plus zero instead of plus one plus zero um, and then we have the Spell Room Painter, which gets plus one, plus one when you cast Sorcerer Instance. And if it's nighttime, it's a 3-4, when it gets plus two, plus two when you cast Sorceries. And you could cast, you know, multiple um, Sorcerer Instance spells. I don't know if we have multiple. We have a, a lot of removal. Like all, our, all of our removal. You know, we got the Candy Grapple. We got the Ambush. We got the Bleed Dry. And then we have a couple sorceries. We got the Vampire's Kiss to make blood tokens, because we could use the blood tokens to discard the Baron and then still cast it with the Madness. And then and the Baron also pluses all vampires. So we did put some vampires in there. Um, you know, we, we drew this one in the deck as well, so I tried to include um, some of the cards that we got in the pack that if I could. Um, so when the... You know, Blood Petal, Celebrant, the 2-1 that has First Strike when it's attacking. And when it dies, it makes a Blood Token. The Apicure makes a Blood Token, so we could use those for the Bargain to Sack. Um, we could also I put the Drought in there. I never saw it. 
but we could use the drought to sack for the bargained cost or whatever else. Um, Besieged Samira also has bargain. Um, so we have a number of things that we can sack to activate the bargain. And then, you know, Celestis makes it nighttime, which is really helpful. Draws you a card, gains you life. Uh, I put in one blood letter just in case you get the ultimate. So one hit with that. And then it also could help out, you know, some other things. But the deck was pretty fast. And with all the removal, you're able to take care of your opponent's uh, creatures and then push it to nighttime and then swing in for some big damage. You know, four damage with Menace. Um, Probably didn't even pay attention to that. And then we got um, two Gig Six Commands uh, to wipe out to wipe the board. You know, you could destroy creatures of power two or less. And their highest, you know, creature most likely they only have a few creatures, hopefully. And then you could give that plus two, um, two plus one plus one counters and life link. So that way, you know, it kind of help out with your life value. Uh, there was that one time I got really close to death, uh, but thanks to the Blood Fell Caves, it gave me one life and kept me in the game. Uh, Varaska, I put it in there for the proliferate um, for Sorin, but it turned out to be a great removal with a minus two to turn their creatures into treasures. All right, packed before 12 days of packs of Christmas, Sorin, day two. All right, looks all right. Not the best, but take it. Do have the nighttime set up? Probably a mill deck. Go into Celestis, go into the other thing. It's gonna be a tough one. Do I celeste this? Hmm. He has flashback, so he can keep it to daytime. We need to get it to nighttime. But we need to get. Could have removal. Get them both, but that's fine. Nothing I can do to that. I gain life back. Gigs. It's looking good. Get the second one out. So that's this. Take the painter. I don't have any 
Let's do the one. And maybe next turn we set up for a big swing. Time. Raska could take care of any creature that he puts out if it survives. The painter can come down. Still making night time. Soaring for the win. Mr. Chabby Land. Two grapples. Baron got Soren. Have to keep this hand. Three removals. Should be good. Nothing to sacrifice for the bargain, but we can take care of Sheldred if we see it. And those are instant spells, so we can take care of, you know, Mono Red. Got enough mana for all our removal. There goes Soren. Yup. Probably has removal for the Baron. He could even have removal for Soren. Oh, gotta slam him down. I think Soren, if he stays, if the Baron stays, I think Soren might. I don't know, I think a card draw might be this is still good. He's gonna kill him in instantly, I think. Flooding out. My ways are not for seven lands. He's gonna get rid of all my removal. Can still block. You wish to know my secrets? Very well. If he doesn't do anything on his turn, it becomes nighttime and I can take out Sheldred. I can do nothing on my turn minus Soren. Balance uh. will never be restored now. He got his value, I got two cards off of him. I 
instant. So we just draw on to nothing. I still think we do nothing. We put a stop at upkeep. And I think we do the ambush while it's nighttime. Oh, and we get the damage. It's nice. So it's working out for us. Trespasser, don't care about. His turn. Gets two guards. Nope. I sure am sure. I can't double spell. But I can single spell. Swing in for four. Save the Baron in case he board wipes. I can Baron. Um, I think we single spell. Attack in, see what happens. Oh, we just took it. Do we put it back today? He might be board wiping. I don't know. Could have another Sheldrin. Oh man. It's fine. I'm sure he wants a double spell. Enough with the mysteries. You don't get to pick. I've come for answers. I get to pick. So, one of your friends has to leave. Mm -hmm. Wow, do we want to kill the Liana? He's gonna make me discard. I don't have enough mana. Max, so get that life gain. There'll be the battle of nighttime. I like it. Uh, I don't have anything to draw and discard, so nothing to discard. I think we still swing in. Two, sack your highest creature. Then we go with this. And then... That'll go for Liliana, and this will go for Lethal, so we'll get Liliana. Unless he just dies. I go back up to 19. I get my guy back. Oh, that's my cue to leave. Oh, end the turn. Keep it nighttime. Nothing in his hand. That's game. Good game. I'll take that action. Give him this. Nothing. That action. That. Oh, I could have done the other thing. Oh, I could have discarded the Baron. It's good. All good. All good. Uh, looks pretty good start. 
One removal. We can sneak out the Baron for cheaper. We put the Baron on in turn two. We can put the Baron on in turn three. Forge deck. I can attack with one. Sneak him out. Can I sneak him out? I need to land. Get him out next turn, I think. One mana. I think we put him out and then we can beseech the mayor to get Zorin or something to deal with that. I don't think I have anything to deal with that. So we need to be able to do more damage. If I get... I do have a land. Something to deal with that would be good. the grapple. I don't know if that was like the best thing. Maybe I could have got something better. Got lethal next turn, possibly. Or I could just pump Didn't plus that. It's weird. Could have removal. I think he has removal. If he removes the Baron, then we're dead. Maybe I should have just attacked with the one guy. That's what I should have did. He could pump that again, pump it twice. I 
am I dead? I think I'm really close. point that land a little bit slow with all these three drops I think we have to take that out, he could have an ob. and do that than this. That's not good. One was a land. I think you go with the Reckless Impulse, or the Reckless Storm Seeker. I think he has a removal, but he has a two... two thing removal. So I can Baron next turn. Haste. It'll come out as four. I think we go with that. You can still have that AWP. Can't do nothing. We could cut him down. We could have cut down. Celestis into... That's good. Lose a life. I think... Man... Is that greedy? Still have cut down. Oh, I see. Put him at four. or he dies. That's it. 
I think we did pretty good. Maybe we lost one game. Uh, I don't even know. Um, but um, this has been told. Uh, have a happy holidays and a Merry Christmas, and we'll see you on day three. <laughs>